hello my pretties how are you guys i'm gonna be doing a collective read i'm just giving spirit um the room space and opportunity to say whatever spirit wants to talk about um one of the things that i want to remind you of the pretty oracle.com i'm gonna it's my website and i'm gonna be having um a black friday sale i think i'm going to focus on the bundles i don't know what it is whatever i do i will be announcing it so try to pay attention to the community board and i know i better hurry up and do it because what i want to do is i want to give you guys um i want to do it before black friday okay um to give you guys room to get you know your spiritual stuff out the way right all right so the vast universe and letting go is what's crowning your read so anyway during the shuffle um i'm getting a lot of like you know that one person that's constantly like um harassing us and you know everybody everybody got this everybody got this the person that rounded up troops and you know um lied slandered your name stole from you all kind of shit um entered into cults <laughs> okay uh in spiritual groups just to be able to learn things to try to harm you this person's life is centered around you okay they care about you a lot more than they care about themselves which is crazy because this is a narcissist <laughs> you get where i'm going with this this is a narcissist so um you know how dare you walk away from me um i'm gonna create obstacles for you i'm gonna lie on you i'm gonna do all of these things right you are being called to let go of this person okay i and 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 the reason why is because there's some sort of connection that that this, that's being made to you through with this person right like it's like they're projecting thoughts and feelings ideas and shit like that onto you but um spirit is saying keep clearing your energy okay keep clearing your energy all this person is doing is trying to remain relevant in your life they are creating like i'm seeing like you know little annoyances like they just sending things to you and trying to make you like probably have like dreams about them or um thoughts about them from the past sending that six of cups energy towards you to try to make you feel nostalgic this person is obsessed and it's affecting your energy for those of you that resonate with this because you you know and i and it came up in the last read that i just did it's like you know feeling like oh just forget it like you know like throwing your hands up wanting to give up because this person is like you know no matter what karma they go through you know they still are dedicated to um doing fuck shit to you like just constantly you know anyway you're being called not you're, you're being called to not lose your hope this person is just trying to lower your vibration so you won't get the things that are coming to you okay that 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 a lot of them they could see it coming for you maybe you can't see it um but your positive actions and and your positive thoughts was pulling it to you your your positive karma what was what was pulling that to you but now you know you have um not shrugged your shoulders what do you call it? you you've dropped your shoulders in 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 some sort of energy of not defeat but like fuck it type energy you know what i mean and they don't want you to do that they want you to remain positive remain um you know grateful to the universe because th that 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 being grateful the energy of being grateful brings your blessings down <sighs> all right let's see so we have catfish someone is not who they appear to be yeah and look at that like i told you purify your energy and your aura constantly cleanse okay um i feel like this person is trying to show up to you like energetically though okay for a lot of us it would be energetically because if you're if you're not actually connected to this individual they could be trying to show up to you um energetically as somebody different oh i love you or you know, I want you to come back. I've changed type of situation, whatever. Okay. I could feel the energy of this person, um, trying to pull you back into something. The crazy shit is <laughs> this person, like, you know, may think that they're doing something, but look at that. Okay. You're very guarded, right? You're very guarded. And this person is like, likes to have like, not likes to have, but just can't help but having sexual fantasies about you, right? 
the crazy thing is it's just annoying you. Like I can feel it and and and, and it's just like yo, leave me alone. Leave me alone. Same. I feel the way you guys feel. Same. <laughs> it's resonating. Like, leave me alone. Leave me alone. You know, this person is like, if you know this person to be a complete asshole, it's like they're trying to show up to you or make you think about them in a positive light. And so that's why we have this energy of catfish here. Someone is not who they appear to be, right? Especially, like I said, if you're not connected to this person physically, you know what I mean? If you're not dealing with this person physically, this person could have like tried to offer you money in a dream state or try, is trying to appear to you. I just heard on social media um, for some of you guys as if they got it like that. They ain't got it like that. If you know, like I said, if you know this person to always be broke and all of a sudden they're like flashing things on social media, like, you know, to try to make you feel like, okay, so this person finally got a job. They finally got their life together. <laughs> so on and so forth. <laughs> Nah, okay. Catfishing. This person is fronting. For a lot of you guys, this person may be um, sending sending the energy of. I'm sorry, y'all. Hold on a second. Um, this person could be sending, trying to send the energy of financial constraints to you. Okay. They could be doing things to try to mess with your money because they're a hater. <laughs> they're a hater. This person could be doing things to try to mess with your money because, you know, maybe they want you to call them and ask them for money or need them for some money or something like that. Pride. I love myself and I see myself for everyone. Y'all, my cards got wet and it's just been aggravating me. Like they just feel horrible. I said it in the last read, but like, come on now. This is like, um, if you guys want to donate decks to the channel, please hit up my Amazon wish list. It's going to be in the description box below. Um, y'all know how something just uh, overly annoys you. <laughs> yeah, it's pissing me off. Um, Cause these, this is one of my favorite decks, but anyway, this person, I feel like they don't, they don't want you to be prideful of yourself. They don't want you to have self-esteem. Like I said, they're projecting this energy onto you, um, um, projecting this energy of anxiousness onto you, stuff like that. Okay. Um, I feel like with this catfish, um, someone is not who they appear to be. They could even be trying to like make you feel like, um, you've changed or you or you know like you you're not appearing to yourself as you would normally appear to yourself like oh I don't feel pretty or oh I don't feel um motivated enough um I don't feel gifted anymore I lost my gifts or I don't feel you know what I mean it's like they they're trying to take from your like solar plexus or whatever the case is the energy of solar plexus like trying to pull you down pull you down yeah look at that okay at the bottom of the deck we have feeling um feeling bound to a current situation i would really um they okay so they telling me like some of you guys need to go put put on some music and dance okay put on that 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 um whatever music gets you gets you makes you feel on and popping beautiful um sexy that kind of music okay if you if you're looking if you're lacking like um creativity put on some go-getter motivation type music okay um to get you in that mood this person is just trying to annoy you like they're, they're just they're just, they they miserable as hell and they want you to be miserable they feel ugly as hell and they want you to feel and they want you to feel ugly yeah, with this victory and psychic awareness and discipline, like this person is literally trying to take over your mind. They're trying to take over your mind. Yeah, uh, interrupt your 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 mental balance. Trying to take over your mind, interrupt the balance in your mentality. Like you know, making you feel um 
Like you can't get away from them. Like this, this is this person energetically. It's like they they chasing you. And it's weird because it's just like go away, <laughs> go away. To invest it. This person is upset because it's like they don't want you to close a chapter with them. They just they do not want you to close a chapter with them. Like you may have even yeah. What is this? What is this? Show me. I feel like a, a third party situation with this individual may have been exposed. If this doesn't resonate as somebody you were dating or with romantically, this could be a friend or a family member. OK, you could have found out that this person was involved in some sort of shit that had to do with, you know, betraying you. This person does not, they're very delusional. They just straight up delusional. Like all they want to do is block you 24 seven. They don't have the idea. They're not, um, they don't have the idea that you have won. Like, yo, this person moved on. Like they won. They're not going to deal with you no more. They're going to keep it moving. Like this person is not trying to hear that. Okay. They want you to second guess yourself. So now they send the energy at you to like second guess yourself. Think that the decisions that you're making are wrong. Um, think about maybe you deciding to leave them could have been the wrong decision. They want you to, um, like, I feel like whatever spiritual gift you may have, this person is trying to get you to think it, um, think it over or, um, think it over. They don't want you to trust your instincts. They just don't. Maybe it could be in reference to who they are as well. Somebody's going to see something. There's something that's going to definitely be exposed. Okay. This person is going to be exposed for those of you. If it's like, you know, you, you, you might think, um, you know, this person is a catfish and I don't mean, you know, literally a catfish, but who, who maybe who you might think that they aren't who they say they are, or, you know, you may have given this person a lot of second chances, whatever the case is. There's something that's going to be exposed coming up soon. Okay. It'll be before next year. There's something about this individual that you're going to, that's going to say, that you're going to say what? Like, you know, if you already know this person to be, um, <laughs> grimy it's gonna get worse you know if you didn't think if you thought you knew them i just feel like the the extent that they have gone through and two is going to be exposed even more okay it says jump into conclusions you may be jumping to conclusions without all the information without all the information yeah because some of you guys i feel like are looking at this person like if you know um I just heard there's plenty of fish in the sea with this catfish energy, the vast universe and letting go. I feel like there's plenty of fish in the sea. Um, this, this, okay. So now there's the energy of this person. You could have had a spiritual conversation with this individual on some gear, yeah, you know, uh, you're my such and such, you my twin flame or whatever the case is. This person is not who you think they are. Okay. I feel like you are basing a lot of, that's for those of you that still connected to this person too. Like I feel uh, for those of you that are basing things off of what this person told you, no, you could be jumping to conclusions without knowing the, the, the full information. Okay. And this is going to come out, pay attention from now 
real close attention from now to January. It seems like something is going to be blown up. Okay. Um, just like zoomed in on. Okay. Um, brought to the, brought to the forefront about whoever this person is. I don't even want to get into it. They just, they basically telling me that this person goes through great lengths to hide who they are. And if you know who this person is and, you, and you've and you already separated from this person because you know how, they, how grimy they are, there's another aspect of this person that's getting ready to knock you off your socks. Like if you thought they were bad, you, you really about to find out how bad they are. How much worse they are. Yo, this could be in reference to a cancer. Let me tell you something. Somebody, there's a dude out here, you know, and I done told y'all, I done told y'all about this dude. He like, he likes certain things sexually, um, that he hides. Put it like that. Put it like that. Certain things that he likes sexually and certain people. That he likes sexually. Okay. I feel like this is definitely going to make you like fully move on from the, from this person. If you thought, you know, yeah, I left this person, but my heart's still with them. Oh no. Oh no. You're definitely going to find out about something, something that they were hiding in the background. And it, like I said, it got to do with some sort of sexual uh, relationship, get together type energy. Okay. Who, what they, what and who they like to do in the dark. What and who they like to do in the dark. Seems like it's going to come out. You're going to grow from this situation. It's definitely going to make you say, uh, if you had a little, a little inch of love in your heart for them. Um, I do feel like um, this is going to dry that up. <laughs> it's like, yeah, I'm never, ever going to mess with you again. Um, there's something really sinister about this person. Like, it's just, and, and I can't even, I don't even, you know, I feel like sinister may be giving, giving them a little bit too much energy. Right. But this person is a trickster. They, they, they trick themselves as well. They don't, I feel like whoever this is, they don't even really know what's wrong with them. They're, they don't even really know what's wrong with them. All they know is how well to, they know very well to hide it though. Okay. I feel like this person is in some seedy ass energy. This person palms could sweat a lot. They're, they're very off balance. This person could be a Sagittarius with the temperance. They're very off balance. Ugh. Let me, I just, let me get out this energy. It's just. Yeah. I, tell me about. Okay. This person was trying to hold you back financially. Like they really, they really are. They trying to hold you back financially. Yeah. You're going to have victory over the situation and you're going to get your money, right? You're going to get your money. You're going to get your blessings, whatever the case is, whatever you was waiting for. Right. The, the, yeah. And then they're going to be sitting there looking stupid. They're going to be sitting there looking stupid. Um, I just, you know, what? Somebody, somebody taking hormones. Look. I ain't got time. It's giving like something about Bruce Jenner or something like that. They saying to me, um, yeah, like somebody is like taking hormones. Like they like, like, I don't know if this person likes, uh, look, I said I wasn't going to do it no more. Yeah. You're going to be successful. Don't worry about this. Um, this person got some real identity. Okay, identity issues with them going on. Um, they trying to hide a lot of things. And um, a lot of it has to do 
with not knowing who they are. Um, for, for a lot of you guys, this person has called on some entities and started playing around with some spirits. This person's brain is like a kaleidoscope, okay? But the but 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 the crazy thing is they have learned to mask this shit so well. Because not only are they hiding it from other people, but they trying to hide this shit from themselves. Anyway, what did I say with this back and forth energy? Anyway, um, I hope that helped you guys.